By turning on multi-factor authentication for Office 365, we can protect your account against unauthorized entry. To start, log in to Office 365 as normal. When your administrator has turned on Office 365 multi-factor authentication, you'll be prompted to set it up for the first time. Simply select Set it up now. There are multiple ways of providing multi-factor authentication. We recommend using the mobile app. You can find this on your Apple iPhone by going to the App Store and searching for the Microsoft Authenticator. Simply click the cloud to download it. Once installed on your iPhone, click on Open. Click Allow to allow notifications and swipe to dismiss the splash screen. When you're ready, click on Add Account. Choose Work or School Account. Click OK to access the camera. Back on your PC, click on Receive Notifications for Verification and click Set Up. A QR code will display on the screen. Simply move your mobile phone to scan it. Setup for multi-factor authentication on your Apple iPhone is now complete. Click Next to continue. The multi-factor authentication setup wizard will then check the activation status. Once complete, simply click on Next. We'll send a test notification to your device. You'll be asked to approve sign-in. And that's it. You'll then be asked to provide a backup authentication method should you lose access to the mobile app. We recommend you use a office phone or alternative mobile number. If you don't have any of these, just use your mobile number and we'll send you a text message. Click finish when you're ready. You'll then be asked if you want to stay signed in. Answer this question and you'll be presented with the Office 365 start page. Now you've set up multi-factor authentication, when you next log in, you'll be asked to respond to this prompt. If you'd like to change your multi-factor authentication settings, simply click on your name in the top right hand corner and go to My Account. Go to Security and Privacy and click on Additional Security Verification. Choose to update your phone number. And from here, you can choose a preferred option. For example, if you don't like the mobile application, you can choose to have a text sent to you instead.